Hi friends, it's Miss Jessie, and today I'm going to read you Too Loud Lily. This is by Sophie Laguna. She wrote the book, and it is illustrated by Carrie Argent. He or she illustrated the book, which means that they drew the pictures. Too Loud Lily. Everyone told Lily Hippo she was too loud. Lily Hippo, keep it down please, I can't hear myself think, said Dad. Lily Hippo, sit quietly, you'll wake up the baby, said Mom. Lily Hippo, you make more noise than a herd of wild elephants, said Lily's big brother. Hmm. I think Lily is a little too loud. Lily tried something very quiet. Lily Hippo, not so loud, they all said. At school, Lily's best friends were Hester and Lou. Hester and Lou, I wonder what kind of animals you see. I see a hippo and a sheep and an alligator, and, is that a bird? Hmm. Sometimes even Hester and Lou were upset with Lily. She was too loud. Then a new teacher came to Lily's school. Her name was Miss Lou Piola, and she wore a big red poncho. She taught music and drama. Lily liked Miss Lupia. She decided to be in the school play. On the first day of rehearsals, Miss Lupia taught everyone a fast stomping dance. Lily tried to do the same dance very quietly. Wonderful work, called out Miss Lupia. But you could try stomping just a little louder this time, please. Lily really liked Miss Lupia. Lily stomped a lot louder. Magnificent, cried Lu Miss Lupia. Lily Hippo, would you like to lead the dance? Lily loved Miss Lupia. Look at that. Lily was in charge of crashing the cymbals and banging the drums for storm noises. Growling and roaring, the fierce lion noises. Cackling and screeching, the, for the wicked witch noises. Singing the song about the very brave prince. And clapping in time to all the music. On the night of the play, Lily was very nervous. What if she forgot what to do? What if she tried to speak and no words came out? Or even worse, what if she was too loud? Lily could feel her heart thumping and her knees shaking. The room was very, very quiet. Everybody was waiting for Lily. Go on. Lily whispered Miss Lupia, nice and loud. Lily took a deep breath. Let the show begin, she said in her loudest voice, loudest stage voice. Lily did her best fast stomping. Her best crashing and banging her best growling and roaring, her best cackling and screeching, and her best singing and clapping. And everybody loved it. Hooray for Lily Hippo, they, all, they cried out. The sound of that clapping and stomping and cheering was very special and very, very loud. 
a bit like Lily. And that's the end of the story, friends. I hope you all enjoyed this book. I hope to see you all soon. Bye.